Hello, Shokomanini. So check this out. The hot tub is where it belongs. It's in it in its enclosure, whatever. They haven't finished it, fixing it. There's still like something missing, but there is the view now. Oh my goodness, it is beautiful. Um so I'm I'm doing better, I'm doing okay. It was really, really hard to work today. Um, oh my gosh, here, I'll show you the sunset. Yeah. Um, and actually, I don't know if I can zoom in, but Victor and the kids, let me see if I can find them. Oh uh, yeah, there they are. They're actually swimming. Let me see. No, me. Um, okay. No, those are other kids. Oh, there they are, they're walking. That's Victor right there in the middle, and that's Naya and Victor in the ocean. I can see them from here, I'm spying. There we go. Um, anyway, so I, um, I realized, ah! Don't worry, I didn't drop my phone. <laughs> it was just the tripod. Um, so I realized that the COVID brain that I thought was a COVID brain is not a COVID brain. Um, it's definitely the meds. So I woke up like super fresh this morning, like feeling really clear minded. And I did some work in the morning and it was fine. And then I took these, the pills and oh my gosh, it was like, I don't know, it feels like like a cat sat on my head and I know this is such a weird analogy but it's like it's like there was an animal sitting on my head <laughs> and it was like heavy here and here and and everything was just like hazy and I couldn't concentrate and I was having meetings and and it made sense but it didn't make sense like it was this weird like it's just such a weird feeling of not having control over my brain um this yeah, these meds are horrible, um, but I think, so tomorrow I still need to take two, and then Friday I just have one left, one pill left. Um, maybe I'll just procrastinate it or, or take it later. Um, otherwise, I'm doing fine. The only thing, last night was really hard to sleep because, um, so I was, ah! <laughs> Oops. <laughs> um, here, I'll just hold it like this, like a selfie stick. Um, it's my tripod failing me. So I was talking to like my friend Allison and I showed her my, my, but my bites that I get bitten at night. And she's like, oh my God, what if you have bed bugs? And I Googled it and, and I was like, oh my gosh, those, the red little dots looks like, look exactly like bed bugs. And, and then she's like, you know, go look in your bed. Maybe you can find them. And then I found like this little bug and I was just like freaking out. And like I sent her pictures and videos of it. It was just like this tiny little like flea looking thing. Anyways, she concluded it was a cute little beetle. Um, <laughs> but the cute little beetle, even though I got rid of it and I did not find any other bugs, um, I was having a really hard time <laughs> falling asleep. I like sat on my chair until like two in the morning because I didn't want to get into the bed. And then I, I literally almost checked myself into a hotel. Um, but then I was just like, whatever, I'm, I'm so tired. I'll, you know, like the, these are just like little red dots. Like they're not, they're not bumps, they're not itchy, they're not painful, um, which are like the symptoms of, of bed bugs. So I'm not, I don't have any of that. Um, it's just, I don't know, something's poking me and at night and drinking my blood. Um, so yeah, anyways, I decided I'm coming, I'm coming home on Friday, not Saturday. I cannot do 14 days. Um, I just can't do it and the the who or the whatever the CDC website says you can release COVID patients after 13 days um, so I'm releasing myself after 13 days not 14 days and I am going home Friday I mean I am I'm home but you know you know what I mean um, I just can't take this anymore um, 
yeah, even though like I go on walks and it's just, I can't take this anymore. Like isolation is worse than anything. Um, and then like, you know, seeing my kids from an eight story building sucks. I mean, it's nice. At least I can see them. They're happy. They're in the water. They're swimming. <clears throat> but, um, yeah. Anyways, I've been eating really healthy until today. I just had this, like, I've been craving sugar, like, really bad. Um, and, like, now that I've been here for, what, isolating since Monday, um, I haven't had any coffee. I haven't had any sweets, like no chocolate nothing um but today i've just been like i went and bought a burger for takeout um i just needed something junky <laughs> just had to have some junk food um yeah otherwise you know i just i can't wait until friday till i get out of this beautiful amazing look at this view look at this view yeah, I'm gonna like switch it over. I mean, look at this view behind me. Just like, look at all this. <laughs> okay, I better not drop my phone. Um, oh wait, let me zoom out. Yeah, look at how beautiful this is. I can't believe I live here. Like, what did I do to deserve this beauty? Um, over there there's still beach so and that's like my room that's where the hot tub is I just cleaned out here I know that's how I clean no but I don't have like the proper thing to clean so it's still dirty but otherwise here you go again here's more beach I might go take another walk um, but yeah so I'm I'm doing good I might, I might actually do some work tonight and then take the day off tomorrow because I cannot work with these meds. They are screwing my brain. So, anyways, that's all I have for my COVID life. So, I am soon to be free. All right, show my